Let her run my fingers down your spine Gonna make you scream, gonna make you whine Gonna lick your thirst, gonna suck your head Gonna jump all over your body Ooh, ooh Give a spider loving Hey, Rudy Van de Sarzio, why are we here in this godforsaken desert? Why do you think that we are here, Spider Dijon? It's because you're all out of ideas and everybody says you're washed up and have no more music left in you. I prefer to think of it as writer's block, Spider Dijon. Only the greatest and most accomplished of musicians get that. So unfortunately, you will never know what that is. Hey, Rudy, I was thinking, why don't we just do what we always do, you know? I'll get some Tantana records, mix them up a little, drink a little tequila, you know? The stuff that we do. This desert is a place free from based pleasures like women and tequila. Anyway, we have turned over a new leaf. We no longer steal from other artists. Ah, this is bullshit. Come on, man, little tequila, little bit of partying, you know. Enough of this talk. Let us get the fire going. Whilst I try to figure out how to find the inner music. Hey, Rudy, I was thinking, but this new inner music, why well, don't record my song, you know, Spider Lovin'? Whoa. Spider, that is not the sound we are looking for at all. Not one bit. That is pornography with bongos. Yeah, but you said it could be a great number one hit. Everyone will listen to it, you said. Let's put it on our next record. We'll call it Spot 11 and the Bongos. I think that that song is something better you should save, you know, for your solo project. Ah, uh, this is bullshit! Why don't you just come out and say it, Rudy? You hate Spider Lovin'. You think it's a shit song. You think that everything about it is shit. Come on, come out and say it. Admit it. Yes, Spider, I admit it. In fact, I hate it so much, I think I want to write you a letter and mail it to you. Key pointing all the parts about it that I hate. Yeah! Yeah, I bet you do, you anal bastard. Why don't you take your bullet-pointed notes and shove them up your anus and choke on them till sunrise, eh? Oh yes, that's right, I forgot. You can't read. <laughs> well, maybe I can read a little, eh? Maybe I can read some names in my phone book, like the name of Carlos. Carlos Santana, I might have known. You know, he's been trying to get me for years, but I didn't go because I thought we were Bongo Brothers. But obviously not, you anal bastard. Well, then why don't you go to him, then? Fine, I will. I don't need this bullshit from you. I'm out of here. Hey, Carlos, baby. Yeah, it's me, you know, it's about the Dijon. Yeah, you know the usual thing. Bit of this, bit of that, drinking tequila. Oh, come on, man, you know, Rudy. Always having to be Mr. High and Mighty. Yeah, that rat is still running about in the dress. <laughs> Yeah, that's right, man. I was wondering, I'm calling you about your offer. You know, if it's still open, I would like to, uh... Hey, Carlos, hold on a minute, man. Will you please? There's a crazy chick over there waving at me, trying to get my attention. Just hold on a minute. Hey, lady, this is an important call for me. Why don't you bamboos? Well, maybe I should return to my hometown that is populated exclusively by women desperate for the love of a man. Hey, Carlos, man, you're breaking up. <laughs> it's very nice to meet you. My name is Spider. Spider? That is a very strange name. Yeah, it's a nickname, you know, because I have eight of something. Eight fingers? No. Do you have eight toes? Nuh-uh. Well, it's because you have it. Ah! Oh. 
So anyway, this time you see Cobb, it's close, very close, just around here. I'm a big girl, I can say eight fingers, you know. <laughs>